There is a new item in the Gucci Garden Roblox event that has not been added to the game yet, but it seems like it's going to be a final prize for the entire event, and it's most likely going to be free. So in this video, I'll be showing it, explaining what I think is going to happen, and just explaining everything that we currently know about it, so make sure to subscribe with the notifications on. I do videos on Roblox events and important stuff going on in Roblox and guides and stuff like that, and like the video. Okay, so first, what is the item? If we go over to the Gucci Garden Roblox event game, then there are our badges here, and all of the items have been obtained by people except for the Gucci Feather and Crystals headpiece. Well, I mean, four people have it, but those are only the developers, I think, so if we just keep pressing a C more, then we can scroll down all the way. And as you can see here, there are Gucci round frame sunglasses. Then if we go to the page of the badge, we can see it was last updated May 27th. So that means this was made two days ago. And well, I thought it was going to come out that day as a free item. Because they just randomly released the Gucci Dim wide brim hat for free, and it got 2.4 million owners. Of course, it's not going to become limited because it was a free item. If this one's free, then it's probably not going to become limited either. But here's the thing, they had all of the normal items already on the game, so these were here from when it first opened. These are all of the ones that are in-game, and they had a date of when they're going to release. They also had the ones that aren't out for a specific amount of time, like you can still get the balloons, and you can still get a few of these items. Like, the ones that you could buy at any time were at the top, well except for one of the caps, but then all of the ones you could find around the map were around here. So yeah, they definitely like had this entire thing separated by what type of items they are. But then down here, they have the free items, so since this item is right by this one, it seems like this will also be a free item, or another type of item, like, for example, how there were the regular items here, then the hidden items, now they're having the final item, but again, probably gonna be a free item like this one. Anyways, it is on the avatar shop right now, so if we go over here, then view all items, create a Roblox, show unavailable items, then search Gucci, and then sort by recently updated. Then we can see the Gucci round frame sunglasses right here, and it doesn't exactly say how you're gonna get it, it just says the description of it and who created it. But here's what I think is going to happen, so they are dark pink sunglasses, and they have gold Gucci symbols on the side, so if we look around in-game, they aren't on the shelves anywhere. This is where all the sunglasses are, then the bags are over there. Nowhere can it be seen around the main part of the game. There are also some things over here, but they don't really have any items on them. It's just some decorations. So it is probably going to be like the previous free item, where on one of the parts of the map, you just go over there, and then you have to press something, then you get it. They did kind of change the game though, where now if you go through a portal and you get teleported somewhere random, you can use the other portals to go to other areas. So you don't have to completely rejoin the game. I think it'd be better if like you could just go through the portal you went through to go back to spawn, but you can't really go back to spawn now. But you can go to other areas, which I guess is also still kind of good. Well, this is the only item in the main part of the Gucci event that hasn't come out yet. So it's going to be out tomorrow. It's named Gucci Feather and Crystals Headpiece. So well, if you're watching this video later, by tomorrow I'm talking about May 30th. And then you're going to be able to get it, and it's going to become limited the next day, just like all of the other items that cost Robux that were out for a limited time. So this item is coming out on May 30th at 2 p.m. EST, and then a second time at 2 a.m. EST, and they stay out for around an hour, but the event closes on May 31st at 12 a.m. PDT, which is 3 a.m. EST. So basically it closes at the same time the second selling of an item ends, but there is no item that day. So that's why I'm thinking that the Gucci round frame sunglasses are going to be free that day and then the event is just going to close then. Like everything in this event was kind of centered around 2pm EST and then 2am EST. So it makes a lot of sense that they're closing it at 3am EST. By the way, if you're confused with all those time zones, you can just look up on Google like... 12 a.m. PDT my time. I mean, Google was kind of glitching. I searched that up and it said 12 p.m. PDT. Like, it didn't even ask me to auto-correct it. It just instantly changed it to 12 p.m. PDT. 
So I guess maybe use a different source than Google, look up time converter, and then type in 12 a.m. PDT or your time zone or whatever. Just like there are multiple tools you can use to convert it to your time. And most of the time Google is going to work. To sum it all up, the Gucci Garden Roblox event is probably going to have a free item that comes out in a couple days, and it's going to be the final item in the entire event. So I'll definitely do a video on it if it is free. If it costs Robux, I'll most likely not. Here's some Something else I wanted to mention in this video that I don't think making an entire video on would really be a good idea because it's not really that important, but in the Gucci Garden event, one of the maps is a train, and as you can see, this looks almost exactly the same as the one in the Block Party event. Like, they literally just copy and pasted it, except they made chairs on the side, and they just slightly changed it, but it's basically the exact same thing. Also, they copy and pasted the exact emote menu from the Little Moss X event, so they're literally just copy and pasting things from other events for that event, so it's probably not gonna be good. So here are some details on the train you should pay attention to. There are these hooks at the top or something, and then decorations on the side videos that you can click on to watch, and then it's kind of just exactly like the block party one, so let's just join the block party real quick to compare them. Uh, it kind of spawned me on top of the train, I guess they use the same glitchy spawning system from the Gucci Garden event, because sometimes it spawns you on top of the map, but look on the sides, it's literally the exact same side as in the Gucci Garden event, how it was dark and then it just passed lights. It's the exact same system, they just copy and pasted it. Okay, I jumped off the train so I respawn, and look, it is literally exactly the same. There are videos on the side, or at least there was a video on the side, I don't know why it's not there anymore, but last time I played there was a video playing there and I could click it, and it was exactly the same as the one in the Gucci Garden event, except for the seats, so... Of course, yeah, there's still those things on the side. A lot of the assets for the train were just copied from the Yoshi Garden game and pasted into this one. It is a little different though, but still, most of it is just copied. I hope Roblox doesn't keep recycling bad events to make more bad events. Like, this one's probably just gonna be a video played on a screen. It could be good though, we'll see, we'll see. I'll definitely try streaming it and I'll probably be able to, it's most likely gonna be, like, there's some mini games you can do, because here it says, or, like, on part of the train, it said that there was a scavenger hunt or something, which is probably gonna be available once the event starts. Like, right now, I guess the train is just the lobby, and it's gonna bring us to the event area, in like five days or however long it is until it starts but we'll see this event could be very good but it seems like it's just gonna be another one where it's a video played on a screen but i guess that's gonna be it for this video sorry if it seems like i'm just saying all roblox events are bad i promise i am not i actually like a lot of roblox events but i've just been kind of disappointed with events recently because for this one they're copying stuff for the gucci one it's just spend your robux and the metaverse champions one was supposed to replace the egg hunt so, I mean, events are not doing too good right now on Roblox, but they are having kind of a lot of events, which is good. Wait, one more thing I want to say, the video is back now, it's not glitched anymore, but I can actually click it, like, in the Gucci Garden event you can click it, and earlier in this event when I first checked it out I could click it, but now I guess it's just broken.